Hi everyone. <laughs> another attempt to start this video. I promised to make another video. Uh, when I had my chat with Nina Rafaela Morocco, um, maybe two days ago, we spoke about my BQH session that she was facilitating and in which we got a lot of very deep information and we were asked in that session to publish the information so that other people who may be looking for information can find it. So it took me about four weeks to actually come to terms with, not really come to terms, but be able to actually word it in a way that I thought I could actually communicate it to others. And this is when we started, Nina and myself, that video. Because in that video, I mentioned that I had volunteered on a higher level, which is a soul level probably, to do certain work for humanity as a collective to help during these times to lessen the pains that people have to go through. I was shown in pictures uh, very uh, precisely what I had volunteered to do. And it seemed to me that it would be appropriate to, to, to make another video about this. So what they explained to me and they are what I heard and knew, the golden dragons that live on a higher vibration and level. The golden dragons showed me that currently there is a lot of light or energy coming towards our planet. And I was shown this as really golden liquid, golden light coming down on the planet. And it's like a um, like a spot. It, it it acts like a spotlight, really, for for each and every person here on the planet, which means um, that a lot of emotional things, traumas, stresses, anxiety, and so forth, will come up for many many people. There is also physical symptoms like sleeplessness, restlessness exhaustion, our heart palpitation, heart aches and so forth because what this wave does it actually tries to open the heart as well and it needs a body system that has um, the capability to hold more light and when people do go through this process and still carry a lot of emotional issues from their past they will struggle a lot, especially when they don't even know what's going on. So they may be frightened, they may be questioning what's going on with them. So I was shown, shown what I can do and I will explain to you what I am doing every single day now because this was the pictures given to me. I saw something that you would be able to liken to a, a movie and in which I was shown what to do. So I sit down in meditation every evening. I prepare myself with breath, with um, making sure that my space is clean and so forth. And then I have to imagine that in front of me is a, a very large table, like a big dinner table that would fit loads and loads, endless actually people. And what I'm doing is I invite every human being on the planet to release their heart aches for me to integrate them on their behalf. And what I perceive then to happen is as if there is like parcels or things put on the table. I do not know who has released what or what it is. I do only feel there is like a heaviness there. And with this with this heaviness of these heartaches, I work. So what I will do is I will acknowledge these heartaches and will tell them that these heartaches are loved and that we are grateful for the heartaches to have been around so that we can learn lessons from it, because this is the whole point.
even though many of you, when they listen to it, will have a hard time to believe this. Um, it is still the case, as I can tell by my own experience, dealing with my own heartaches and other blockages, as I call them. So I just explain this in this way so that the, the people who can resonate and will resonate with what I say can actually do similar work. The whole point is in acknowledging and then allowing this energy, this heartbreak to go into the light. This is the way I, I say this. And I thank it then. Afterwards, I will ask the source of everything or God, whatever you may call it, or creation, to flood the bodies and the energy bodies of these people with the golden white light of the universe. So this is the process I'm doing. And I do actually feel um, lighter after I've gone through the process. So the whole process may be very structured but it has to be done from the heart um, and this is what I do. So I would never know and maybe you would never know <laughs> if your soul level had agreed on allowing you to let go of one, two, three, whatever amount of heartaches. But you may actually at some stage start to feel better you may have um, less pressure on your chest or just have the ability to smile more and laugh a little bit and things like that. So this is this is, this is what I've volunteered to do and I do it really and I'm, I'm joyful about this, this task. So I really enjoy that. Um, Nina as well asked in the session if we can do this for our family members that we know are not um, awakened yet, are not aware of the processes that are going on on the planet and maybe struggling a lot. And the answer was yes. The same pro process can be applied. So we just have to be very neutral about it, not judging anything that's going on in anyone's life. So we can then ask that maybe of all of the family members, whatever heartaches or uh, blockages can be released for the purpose of the meditator to integrate it on their behalf. On their behalf is extremely important because it means that the integration becomes the integration of that trauma or emotional blockage becomes an experience, a neutral experience for the person that it can use later without having to go through the same emotional um, pain. This is the whole, the whole point of me taking on this task on a higher level and now being made aware in that session that I am willing to do this. So it is on their behalf. So it's not being uh, made go away or uh, somehow... Um, a light has been flashed on it to make it go away like a pill would, would make the, the pain go away. This is not the point. The point is of integration. So this is what I'm doing. And um, in the process of all this, I have also decided um, in the future to do more work in this area. But I will announce this on my Facebook page, Be Heart. And uh, hopefully I can help a little bit more to ease people's pains, the physical and the emotional with the work that um, I've been given. So that is so to say my homework out of the BQH session with Nina Raffaele Morocco. So if you have any questions or anything, just post the questions below or on my Facebook page. I thank you all dearly for listening to this and I hope it makes sense. Bye bye for now and I love you all to bits.